Hi. I've been gone for a while. So, Happy Thanksgiving, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, and Happy Valentine's Day. So, I cut off my locks. They are gone. Uh, this was not planned. I know in another video I told you guys that if I ever decided to cut my hair, I'd first come and tell you. Uh, I did this at the beginning of January. I woke up in the middle of the night at midnight. I had a itch I could not scratch right in the middle. And there was some scissors in the bathroom. I picked up the scissors and I just started cutting. I didn't even try and unravel anything, didn't try and comb out any locks. I cut straight to the new growth. So I had about four inches of, of hair that was just sticking up everywhere. By this time it's two in the morning and I had to go to work and I had this big dirty afro and I didn't know how long it was going to take to get it clean. So I had this bright idea. I found a box of honey blonde hair dye underneath the sink and I said, this, these chemicals will strip all the buildup out of my hair if I don't leave it on long. So I covered my hair in honey blonde and I left it on for 10 minutes and it worked. The chemicals stripped all the stuff out of my hair and it lightened my hair slightly, not enough that you could really notice. Um, then I, I did two strand twists all over my head and later on, a few hours later, I um, opened them up and I had like this really cool textured afro. By the way, I will post pictures of everything I'm talking about at the end of the video. So for a month, that's what I did. I um, would, in the evenings, twist it up, and in the mornings, just with my fingers, pull it apart. Um, the problem was, was that every evening having to comb it out and braid it up, my scalp was so tender because I was locked for four years, never having combed my head, and my scalp just had gotten used to being left alone. So almost two weeks ago, I'd had enough, and I told my husband, who, by the way, is an actual barber. He graduated from barber school right out of high school, and he was working as a barber for about two to three years before coming to college. So I have the ultimate hookup in the house. Anyway, I went to my husband, and I had him just take it down like this. So this is how I've been wearing my hair. Uh, the one regret I have is that I didn't do this when it was warmer. It has been unseasonably cold. <coughs> Pardon me. <clears throat> and my head's been cold. So actually, I've been wearing a few wigs every now and then. I'll throw on a wig if <coughs> <coughs> it's been really cold. And I'll post pictures of my wigs and my afro and everything. So what I've been doing with my hair is I wash it about three times a week, almost every morning. And um, I've been doing the rub method. I've been using this product. In previous videos, I've mentioned Shea Moisture products, which I adore. And I found this under my sink also. And it actually is not expired. So it is the Shea Moisture Curling Gel Souffle. And I take about a quarter sized amount of this and I rub it all through my head. And then I've been doing the rub method. Some people use their hand, a brush, but I have found that a dry washcloth works for me. So I dry my hair with just a towel. Um, you can do this on dry, I do it on dry hair, my dry hair or semi damp hair. And I go in a clockwise motion all over my head like this. And what this does is, as you can see, it defines my coils and curl pattern and kind of just gives a little life to my, I guess this is a teeny weeny afro, I don't know. I'm due for a shape up. Um, I made an appointment with my hubby for tomorrow, so I'm just going to get the sides defined and um, see if I could turn around the back. Oh. Keep in mind, this is almost two weeks old, but this is what the back looks like. So I'm just going to get the edges lined up a little bit. Um, I might take a little bit off the top and a little off the sides, but here's my hair. Now, I am not sure what I'm going to do about my channel. You know, 95% of my videos are about hair, and I don't have any hair or much to talk about. So, I guess every now and then I'll pop in and say howdy. I want to say the last three years here on YouTube have been great. Um, I have made actual friends 
um, through YouTube and through locks and hair, which I just think is a beautiful thing. And I appreciate your love and your support. Uh, I apologize to all my new subscribers who just subscribed. Because of my locks, they're gone now, and I am so sorry about that. Um, I do hope that my other videos that are up can give you some information and insight. Um, feel free to leave comments and questions below. Also, follow me on um, Instagram and Twitter if you want to stay connected and get a peek into the shenanigans which is my life. So stay tuned for pictures right now. Bye.